Hi, welcome back. This is the evening stretch. Let's get started. So tonight's focus is going to be shoulders. So lots of times we get really hunched over from our day. So all of these stretches are going to be for you to open up and mobilize this upper area. So we're going to start against a wall. So you're just going to start with your right arm making a little like 90 degree angle. Let me grab my timer. And you're going to just bring it behind you. So you're facing forward and your elbow is behind you. You're pressing into it and trying to get this shoulder to drop down as much as possible. And you just look forward, lean into it just slightly, just to where you can feel a stretch for yourself. And actively push the shoulder down. Actively push it down. And you still want to be lifted up through the belly. And just breathe. This is a great stretch to do even if you're at work and you're just feeling really tight in the shoulders. You can just walk up to a wall. You can do this standing very easily. And you just hold this stretch. Good, breathe. Keep actively pushing down the shoulder. Feel lift even as you're sitting here, lifting up through the hips. Good, let's do two more deep breaths. Last one. Good, other side. So take that elbow, line it up with your shoulder, get pretty close to it, and then lean into it, hand is up. This shoulder presses down as much as possible, keep lifted up in the lower belly. So there's a nice twisting action, my elbow is shooting that way, and then I'm looking forward. So you're getting a nice rotation and a really nice stretch in the shoulder. Good, again, you can always close your eyes if that feels better for you. And you're always more than welcome to pause the video and continue on with a longer stretch if that feels good for you. Let's do two more deep breaths. Inhale in through the nose. Exhale out through the mouth. Last time, inhale in. And exhale out, good job. All right, we're moving on into a nice eagle stretch. So you're gonna take your left arm and you're gonna swoop it under your right. You're gonna try to clasp the hands so that they're flat against each other. If they end up, if your hands end up bubbling out like this, that's okay. You just work your way up to having flat hands. So you're gonna try to lift the elbows up towards your nose and your shoulders are gonna stay down. Hold here. We're gonna open up the throat by letting the head release back. Open up the throat and the chest. Good, just breathe. We won't stay here long, about four breaths. Two more. Good, other side. So you're gonna swing that right arm underneath. Have those hands Press against each other, lift up through the belly, lift the elbows up, drop the head back, <clears throat> four breaths. Two more. Last one. Good, slowly release down. All right, we're gonna come all the way down to the mat and we're going to start on our floor, on, the, uh, on our stomachs. So you're gonna start in a, uh, in hands underneath shoulders like as if you were doing cobra pro pose and you are going to 
extend your left arm. We're gonna do both sides, so it doesn't matter if you start on either one. You're gonna just lay all the way down, rotate your body over so that you come onto that hand. Place that right foot down onto the floor and hold here. If this is good for you, you can keep going and you can add in the second leg. If this is also good for you here, then you can pull up your fingers like I'm doing, take the other arm, grab them, and hang out here. Only if the other two were okay for you. Good. Just relax. Two more breaths. Last one. Good, other side. Gently all the way back over. Start just like we did on the other side. Two hands underneath your shoulders. Reach the arm out and roll yourself towards that arm. Let me move my timer. Good, place the foot down if that's okay for you. Grab, put two feet on the floor. And again, if that's good for you, then take the top arm up and create a bind. Make sure that you're just flipping the fingers up. You're just, you're not rotating that bottom shoulder. And just breathe. Close your eyes if that feels good for you. Just relax. Even as we stretch our shoulders, you still want to try to relax them as much as possible. Two more deep breaths. Last one. Good, slowly roll yourself back over to the mat and come on up. So we're gonna come into a squat. So two feet are gonna be just outside of your shoulders. You're gonna sit in this squat. Take the hand behind your back, so they go behind the back, and then the elbows come forward in front of your knees. And you're gonna use the, your knees to stretch your shoulders open. So you just lift up, try to drop the tailbone, squeeze the lower belly. So I see some people, they stay hunched over like this, right? That creates a really rounded back. That's not good. So you want to sit up against the stretch as much as possible. This is a pretty deep one. So if this is difficult for you, you could always skip it or just, you know, do it uh, not as long as I'm going to do it. So we're going to do about another 30 seconds here. Again, you can close your eyes if that feels more calming for you. Keep the lower belly squeezing in, lifting up tall. Good, let's do two more deep breaths. Inhale in. Exhale, try to lift taller. One more time, inhale in. And exhale, let it go, good job. All right, sit all the way down, clasp those hands behind you, just you're sitting up nice and tall. Another shoulder stretch, you're gonna take the arms back and you're just gonna lean into it just as much as you can, uh, whatever feels comfortable for you. So you still wanna pull the lower belly in, lift up through the chest. This is an amazing, amazing shoulder opener. So squeeze the lower belly, lift up, try not to sink, right? This is a, you can see how my shoulders are rounding forward. You want the shoulders to round back. Lift up, try to squeeze your hands. So clasp the hands tightly together instead of letting the, uh, the wrists open up like that. Keep the, uh, sorry, not the ankles, the wrists together. Good. 
Good, come on up. And we're just going to switch the class of the hands. So take the other thumb on top, bring it back. Lift up through the chest, feel a nice strong lift. And just breathe. Good, two more deep breaths. Last one. And come on up, nice. All right, uh, one more stretch. We're going to start with, uh, basically you're gonna start in a plank. This is just to get ourselves in the correct position. So you're in plank pose. You're gonna reach your right leg across. So you come into a 90 degree angle. So you're gonna get a little bit of a leg stretch in this too. You're gonna drop the hips down, making sure that this is 90 degrees, right? You don't want the leg to be all the way down there. Have it in 90 degrees. You're gonna reach the right arm forward. So you have right arm out, right leg out. Then you're gonna take this hand and then you're gonna reach it through, thread it through and stretch out the shoulder. Hold it here. Just breathe. Trying to relax the shoulders, keeping the lower belly squeezed in. Finding those nice deep breaths, calming you down for the, to wind your, your day down. Just let everything go. Good, last breath. And slowly come on up. Good job. Didn't that feel good? I think so. Okay, other side. So we're gonna start in plank, and we're gonna take that bottom leg, reach it out so you're, it's at a 90 degree angle. Reach the left arm forward, reach the right arm through, come all the way down, and then rest the head. Keep reaching through the body so the arm is reaching forward, the legs are reaching out. Create space in your body, create length. The breath should help you create that space. Good, last big deep breath in. And exhale out, nice, good job. Come all the way up. Alrighty, and it's time for our meditation. For our meditation, we're gonna lie down on the ground. Legs are gonna be just flat down on the floor. Palms are facing up towards the ceiling. Shoulders are down. And just close your eyes. Let your breath get deeper and deeper. Good. So during this time, I want you to try to relax in every single part of the body. So I'm gonna guide you through this. So starting at the top of the head, see if you're frowning your forehead or your eyebrows. Let the head just be heavy on the floor. Relax your eyes, your nose, your jaw. Traveling down, your neck should feel nice and loose. 
Relax your shoulders down into the ground. Feel your hands and wrists really heavy into the floor. Good, soften across the chest, the ribs, the lower belly. Feel the sacrum heavy into the floor. Relax your thighs, your knees, your ankles, and then finally just let your feet just fall open to the side. So lay here, breathe deeply in through the nose and out through the mouth. Good, take two last deep breaths in. Exhale. Again, inhale in. Exhale out, good. Wiggle the toes and fingers to wake yourself back up. Roll over to one side. Carefully make your way all the way back up into a seated position. You can keep your eyes closed for this whole time. Let's bring our hands in towards our heart and bow your head down towards your heart. Good, one more deep breath in through the nose. Exhaling out. Good, bowing our head down towards our heart as a signal of gratitude for giving yourself the chance to thrive, to giving your body what it needs, to taking the time to let itself heal and to always improve. One last deep breath in. And exhale it all out. Thank you so much. I hope you have a wonderful night, evening, and a restful sleep. See you tomorrow morning.